I'm watching this movie. Cowboy Counselor. Cowboy Counselor. <laughs> Let me tell you, this is like one of the best actors I've ever seen in my life. i got to find out his name. And he reminds me of somebody that I used to know. I'm not going to mention no names, but he was a cheater eater. Cheater eater. I would never want to play a game against him because he cheats like hell. But I, I'm not disrespecting him. I loved him. I loved him. Because, um... He had exuberance, he had excitement, and he wanted to win. And it didn't matter, money didn't have nothing to do with it. He just wanted to win. And I understand that. I actually understand that. I do. I do understand that. But for him, it was compulsory. For me, it's that who's a bad luck. Bad luck. Bad luck. But however, you know, he's got a house and home and kids, and I got a little apartment and a cat. <laughs> and if that's the way it ends up to you, then there you go. But I think I'm happier than him by miles, actually. Truthfully, sad to say. Because I really like this guy. I really like him. But he's got that. And you can't always. Sometimes you gotta lose, man. Or something. I don't like Vince Lombardi. I think that's bullshit. Win at all costs kind of crap. What you do is you play the very best that you are able to execute as best as you are able to and have a freaking Beckham, wreck him on your side. Too sweet. Too sweet. Too sweet. Too sweet. Too beep. Have a pick and wreck on your side, G, G, G. Have a pick and wreck on your side. Let me tell you now that I'm thinking football. Oh, I'm so impressed this year. And I'll tell you, I guarantee you, I know this is a fact. And it's not fake news. And the players... Are all stepping up. And it's because of the fans. Honestly, I never seen oh more second efforts and third efforts and, and the coaches are going crazy with these crazy wild calls. Everybody's going cuckoo because the fans are back. Swear to God, that's what it is. And I love that. Because it shows they appreciate us. And it's, we don't get to know that. We They know we appreciate them. Well, sometimes we don't because people are assholes. But uh, I sure appreciate my football players. And I love Brady. And I can't understand Brady haters. Uh, that's totally ridiculous. I mean, at this point, at this day and age, and you can't love that mother son bum beach B E E C H not a curse, not a curse. And even that's all folks. But I'm just saying. I've been loving football this year. It's so good. So good. Every single team. The Lions looking nice. Chicago looking nice. Atlanta Chargers. <laughs> I'm just playing. I'm not sure about so much the charges. So much. I gotta check them because it seems like every single team has a really good quarterback. I'm just thinking, I can throw. Can't throw a football that good as good. I throw a baseball a lot better. But you gotta have them big monkey hands throw that football. Then I'm got. 
See, I don't got that. I don't, I don't got no. I don't barely cover my face. I got monkey arms though, and then I could throw that ball like a like a like a monkey. Hundred dollar fastball. I guarantee you, when I was younger, oh, I guarantee probably more than that. Shoot, I was afraid to be a pitcher because I might hurt somebody. No, I'm serious. I can't. Couldn't do it. I had to put me in left field, coach. And they just they put me in left field. Called me a ball hawk. I loved that. I loved that. That was nice. I couldn't pitch. Richie Rich, that was his real name. He wanted me to pitch. He was a catcher. He was playing catcher. He could do anything, I think. He was a very, very, very talented. I looked up to him. He was like uh, just a very cool dude. He had long, long hair back in the hippie days, and it's like the way I would like mine to go, but mine can't do that. And he was slick. He moved real slick and shit. He was a cool dude. I liked him very much. Very slick dude. One of the slickest people I ever met. And he wanted me to be a pitcher, and he was trying to talk me, convince me into throwing my curveball. And I'm saying, what if it don't curve and it's going to hit the guy in the ribs? And I really was, couldn't do that. I really couldn't, man, because Jesus like a bullet, man. I'm not joking, son. It seems funny, man. I don't know. It's real, real stuff, real stuff, real stuff. And then when I was in left field, I threw people out at first base. Yeah, you know, like third to first, left field to first. How about that? I did it twice. Yeah, man. I had a hell of an arm, baby. I'm not lying, man. That too, 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 too. Ah, the older kids, you see them and say, hey, dude, you got a hell of an arm. And I'm like, I f oh, you know how much I love that when they said that. Ah, oh, thank you. And when my coach called me a ball hawk, I was very happy about that, too. It's nice to be acknowledged. I know I play my ass off. Nice to have somebody back you up on. Think you're doing good. And now I know I'm doing good now. Yeah. Yeah, thank God for people like that, man. Love them, man. Thank you. Made me feel special. Yeah. Truly, truly. Going through my memories, man. Going through my memories. Oh, tip to do the tulips. Oh. Where have all the doobers gone? Ha he. I don't know. I don't know. It would be nice, a nice Disney movie. Disney is nice. Oh, we got the beautiful blonde girls. Well, you got to go back to my time in the 60s and 70s. And always Haley Mills. And Plachette, Suzanne Plachette, was she one probably, I think? Dick Van Dyke and, 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 Everything else good though. Yeah, Disney movies, baby. Just watching them every Sunday, every Sunday, baby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Disney and then Ed Sullivan. Ed Sullivan. Oh, we finally get together on the couch, the living room, TV that had to get up to change the channels and all that stuff, three channels. You'd be watching Channel 2, Ed Sullivan, I'm pretty sure it may have been 4. No, I think it was 2. I don't know. 
I really can't remember that. I can't. Don't ask me to. It's not no big deal. No, don't. I think Walt Disney was NBC now that I think about it. I took a shower today. I don't know what to do. I mean, it's itchy. Kind of live with it. Yeah, shoot. Well, at least I got jalapeno pepper poppers. Jalapeno pepper poppers. Watching the awesome movies. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, this guy's so good. I gotta find out his name. Serious. I'm enjoying this like crazy. Crazy. Since 9 o'clock, I can't play no music, so. I got nothing. Nah, I really could. Legally, 10 o'clock. But around here. Uh, nothing, nothing. <laughs> they don't care about the law. You shut your face. I'm not that in play nothing. What does it mean? What does it mean? Hey man, you know, gotta do. I deal with the courage given, man. Working for a living, taking what they're giving. Don't smoke no doobie. Just smoke mar marijuana. Okay? Remember that. Don't smoke dope. The kids. Don't smoke dope. Just smoke marijuana. You'll be fine. Don't smoke no dopey in the Piscogee. Dope. Boopy, 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 boop. You find to love Adeline. Oh, Adeline. Oh, shit, that's my, uh, friend's daughter's name. She. That's a song, a Western cowboy song. Adeline. Oh, really, isn't it? Pretty damn sure. Yeah. Mm. I like names that start with A. I took care of a little girl named Amelia. Amelia. I like names with A. Amanda. I think she's a real cutie. Remember where the Amanda? I like little girls. If I was gonna have a kid, I would have a little girl. Cause I already know about the guys. I, I was one. It would be interesting to have a little girl grow up right in front of you and the sweet man. That would be amazing. If I was gonna have a kid, I would want a girl. I absolutely. Would. That would be interesting. We trouble though. Believe me, don't you think I know? That's why I care about that. I don't got no kid, do I? But, uh, but I borrowed other people's. And I took care of them, okay? You just ask me. I took care of them, okay? I treated them like special human beings, kind of thing. Because they were special. Ooh. I enjoyed it. Used to watch. Used to watch Urkel. 
We watch Urko. <laughs> we love Urko. Oh, shoot. We love Urko. Oh, boy. We love Urko. <laughs> then Jerry Springer came on, and then I didn't feel exactly right letting her watch that crap. Not, I'm not even really crazy about that crap because that's really crap. But then after that came Chips, and me and Paul, her actual father who had a brain tumor, we would sit and watch Chips and smoke a bowl. I loved him. He was a good friend, man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, that bowl would come out all the time. Every time chips came on, hey, buddy. Hey. Bowl time, but bowl. Well, he was like that. Oh, yeah. Hell oh, yeah, baby. Party time, baby. Very giving, generous man. No dog about it. And he moved from Schenectady to come to me in Binghamton because he knew I'd look after his family because he had a brain tumor. I did what I could in my limited ability. No car, no motorboat, no the single luxury. But I did my best to give them all the love I had to offer. I think I did fairly okay. Better than fairly. Because I really did love them. <laughs> oh, good girl. Oh. Pow. Pow, pow, pow. Now she's a mom with kids of her own. <sighs> Unbelievable. Good stuff. She did well. She had little kids. She treats them well. She's a real sweetheart. Always was. Always loved her. Oh, jeez. I love at first sight. No, she was a little kid. Don't get me wrong, but I just had this boom. I love that girl. You know? Something about her that's just phenomenal. She's got life. She got life better. Mm, got that. Duh. Oh, that's a, she had, and her brother, too. Phil. Phil's father got drumming lessons from Gene Kruper, who is arguably the best drummer in the universe. But I'll stick my foot in it and say I go with John Bonham. Sorry, that's how I feel. Because in my book, John Bonham could play four fifths, five eighths, nine tenths, twenty hundreds, all at the same time, and I have no idea what I'm saying. But he can do that. And I sure can. <laughs> I wouldn't even try. But I love him for doing it. I'm saying the same time I love you, baby. Love you, baby. Maybe. John Bonham forever. I want to song. The Crunch. Oh, check that. Oh, bam. Four fifths, nine eighths, hundred and twentieths, fifty fifths, 
and five six on a downslide with the poop poop and the pop pop and the oh my gosh, I couldn't do it. He sure could. <laughs> He's an animal. John Bottom. Knock me out. I gotta shut these guys off sometimes because I'm getting old. This shit excites me like crazy. It's just so damn good. It's like. You know, that kind of stuff. <coughs> mm -hmm. I gotta like, pause, 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 let's play a game or something. Because it's like, Jimi Hendrix or something, and Slime Family Stone, goodness sakes. Gobby, 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 Neil Young. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I love it, believe me. All my brothers, it's like, boom, gotta shut it down, shut it down, pause. I really do. It's the feeling that gives me stuff so fast. And anything I want, it's right there. It's like, whew, killing me, knocking me out. It's too good. It's too too damn good. Gotta take a break. Gotta take a break. Oh, Scott, I mean, serious, serious. It's not, it's not right. You gotta take a break. You gotta whew, process, 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 and then go on. That's how it is for me. I swear to God. Yeah, I'm not kidding, man. I know. I'm an old man, damn it. Shit. It's not my damn fault. Fuck you. I'm gonna have my mother sit. Back off. <sighs> oh, that's the guy's honest truth, where uh, it is. I'm into you. I try not to be into you. I can't help it. I'm sorry. <laughs> you know I'm not sorry. Well, I am. I wish I wasn't itchy. <laughs> the good guy, Miss Molly. Sure, no animal. Whatever that means. She's a suave bola. Oh, 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 look at this big weed. Oh, 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 I got, I got, I got, I got, I got jalapeno pepper papa. Yes, I do. Fuck it. It's not 10 o'clock. Fuck you. Legally, I got every fucking right. God, fuck damn, damn you. Shit. Sorry. I swear, man. I get excited. Sorry. I apologize. I'm such a bad man. I really am. I am terrible. 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 I apologize. Sorry, I'm sorry. You don't get that. You don't. You just like to hear it.
really missing my E string, and I don't feel like playing if I don't got an E string. So what's going on here, Jerry? Honestly, I gotta go get find my E string because I know I got. I got yeah, there's a bit. Plenty of E strings hiding out somewhere in the music. Just gotta look for them, you know what I mean? Me, 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 So I got a lot of good stuff, and I got to clear my head, and I guess that's what I'm kind of doing now, <laughs> to tell you the truth, it's like the stuff is blowing me away, and it's like I got to boom, bam, take a pause, take a pause, take a pause, it's just good stuff, I mean, even this western I'm watching is giving me palpitations, this guy is so good, oh, so Really good. I gotta find out his name. Oh my god, I'm not lying. I'm not lying. Oh, he's so funny, man. It's cool. Sweet. <laughs> it's not <coughs> the horse sorcerer. I don't know what made me think that. There's something of that nature. The Cortez on. Enforcer. No, it's not that either. I have no idea. I, I just, I just don't know, man. It's not my fault. By me, baby. Beep, 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 beep. I might not be no Tony Schwartz. Not no Tony Schwartz. But I'm putting B B B B B. Putting B B B B B. Little bit of B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B Let's <laughs> 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 